Autumn will be here before we know it, but Las Vegas is, of course, known for our sizzling summer heat. 13 Action News' Jason Denant shares insider tips on the best places to send summer off with one last splash. Follow me for some cool spots to enjoy one last summer dip and Vegas like a local with insider tips. There are a few more weeks left to enjoy the water at Lake Mead before the chilly weather arrives. If you want a good spot at the popular Boulder Beach, you better set your alarm early. It opens daily at 6.30 a.m. and you will find that it fills up quickly, especially on weekends this time of year. If you want to enjoy a hidden cove or more secluded beach, rent a boat or a jet ski and venture off on a day away from the crowds. This will also allow you a chance to get up close to the Hoover Dam for that epic photo. Not far from Lake Mead, you will find Lake Las Vegas, another oasis in the desert. This one has an aqua park made of oversized obstacle course and huge slides. Tickets are available through September and can be bought in 45 minute sessions. Here's a tip. One session costs $27 per person. Book online and get a two session pass for $37. Double the fun for only $10 more. You can also try the Flyboard Water Jetpack experience. Beginners won't get that wild, but it's still fun. Cowabunga Bay Water Park offers a summer ending Friday night beach party. For only $24.95, enjoy the park from 4 to 9 p.m. The park will also remain open on weekends through September. And I hear they're going to be announcing a winter-themed event coming soon. Before I go, we all know ice cream is another great treat to cool off on a hot day, but it's also a great treat all year round. Locals know CJ's Italian Ice and Custard is a favorite. From their spicy sandia to brownie sundae, you'll always leave with a smile. My favorite is the blueberry crumble. Mmm, yum yum. Till next time, explore Vegas and never be afraid to whip out your Nevada ID and ask, Hey, do you offer a local discount? Jason Denant, 13 Action News. We'll be back with more of How to Vegas after the break.